Regional Center for Biotechnology is located in a tranquil environment along the Gurugram Faridabad Expressway. It is an autonomous institute established under auspices of UNESCO by the Department of Biotechnology, Government of India. The primary focus of RCB is to provide world-class education, training to create high-quality human resource in biotechnology and conduct innovative research at the interface of multiple disciplines. The infrastructure at RCB has developed at a rapid pace since inception of the institution in 2010 with state-of-the-art research labs, teaching labs, innovative classrooms, central instrumentation facilities, small animal facility, biosafety level 3 facility, a biorepository and state-of-the-art advanced instrumentation facilities like the Advanced Technology Platform Center and a bio incubator which serves as a reservoir for incubating ideas in the area and help them reach commercialization. There are various areas of research in RCB. The research group under the area titled Cell Biology, Development and Behavior focus on unlocking the secrets of cells, how they divide and how stem cells develop into muscle in addition to studying the cellular and molecular origins of how organisms behave. Areas of agricultural biotechnology aim to tackle some issues by harnessing the existing genetic diversity in plants and their inherent capacities to adapt to abiotic and biotic stress conditions in order to develop innovative and durable methods of crop improvement. Groups working on infectious diseases, both bacterial and viral, aim at developing novel therapeutic strategies against infectious agents. Using tools such as mass spectrometry and microscopy, these researchers will shed light on cellular and molecular basis of bacterial infection and the response of the human host towards these infections. They are trying to find novel solutions to protect the people against diseases such as chikungunya virus, Japanese encephalitis virus and dengue virus. Protein structure and design groups are structural biologists who have a molecular view of life and use cutting-edge methods like macromolecular X-ray crystallography or cryo-electron microscopy to imagine biological molecules in their functional state. This information is used to develop novel therapeutic strategies against pathogenic bacteria and viruses and for protein engineering to prepare molecules with desired properties. Researchers at RCB are also working towards developing innovative biotechnological applications such as novel drug delivery systems, new diagnostic tools, novel engineered protein with improved desired proteins and improved methods to obtain desired products in large scale. These researchers subject laboratory and clinical samples to cutting-edge microscopy. Proteomics and genomics methods coupled with flow cytometry to shed light on the etiology of disease and utilize this knowledge to identify solutions to these disorders. The quality of research conducted at RCB is excellent with faculty winning top honors like the Shanti Swarup Bhatnagar, the National Bioscience, the Innovative Young Biotechnologist Awards and the Ramanujan, Ramalinga Swami and DBT Welcome Alliance Fellowships. Since research-based learning is the hallmark of RCB, the academic programs here are deeply enmeshed with the research programs. The academic programs fulfill RCB's core mandate to provide quality education and training in the area of life sciences and biotechnology. The PhD program in biotechnology is for students who are interested in working at the interface of multiple disciplines to find novel solutions for problems in health and agriculture. RCB has recently started integrated PhD program in biotechnology offered to students with graduate degree in any discipline of science from India and abroad.
The program provides extensive learning opportunities in the broad field of life sciences and biotechnology. RCB has also recently initiated an interdisciplinary doctoral programs in the area of biostatistics and bioinformatics through collaboration with the global pharmaceutical giant GlaxoSmithKline GSK being conducted in partnership with other institutions by creating a virtual faculty pool. The focus of this program is on creating specialized manpower for the healthcare industry. As an outreach activity, RCB also offers research training programs for research-driven undergraduate and postgraduate students of science from various universities. Trainees get a realistic experience of several facets of modern biological research that sets the tone of their embarking on a research career. Throughout the year, RCB hosts and organizes regular academic events like the RCB Bioimaging School, national and international conferences, seminars, symposia and training in the frontier area of basic and applied sciences in topics such as infectious diseases, drug discovery etc. to disseminate advanced knowledge, exchange ideas, foster national and international collaborations, student exchange and networking opportunities. RCB also holds scientific communication and communication workshops for the benefit of young scientists in India. RCB has a fully functional library and houses 500 scientific textbooks and 100 administrative books in multiple copies. In addition, an electronic library provides access to a vast range of primary literature in the form of peer-reviewed journals and reviews. RCB offers faculty residences and excellent students' facilities including on-campus air-conditioned hostel accommodation, modern library, meeting rooms, seminar rooms and auditorium. The hostel and student facilities are conveniently located and only a short walk away from the classrooms and laboratories. In addition, the campus also has sports and recreation facilities which encourages all-round development of the students. Campus also provides a childcare facility for all students and staff to help them continue their studies and work while their babies are being taken care of. Kridangan, the creche housed in the faculty building is an asset on campus for employees of NCR Biotech Cluster. The spacious cafeteria in the campus serves hygienic, nutritious and delicious meals and beverages at reasonable cost. RCB also contributes towards creating resource for researchers from all over India and has engaged with institutions such as the European Synchrotron Radiation Facility in France towards this end. RCB is also involved with the UNESCO towards developing policy to ensure sustainable development at the global level and specifically in the Asian region. RCB is a young institute which is growing day by day with excellent opportunities for young people to make a career in the area of biotechnology.